if you're putting a trolling motor on your kayak, one of the things you got to do is wire up the battery to the motor. Let me talk about the best way to lock in Quick Connects. I strongly recommend that you use Quick Connects you know, like this when you're hooking up the battery to your kayak motor because it just makes it so much easier to get everything on and off the boat. The problem I found with these Quick Connects is that they're hard to get the wire to stay in the Quick Connect connection. And here's why. If you look at this thing, it's basically a big old tube within the connect part down at this end. And the challenge is, of course, you got to use marine wire for this. Marine wire is multi-stranded. Multi, uh, multi and so when you try and clamp this like you normally would to lock in the wire, all those multi-strands just pull out. So here's a trick that I saw someone else do, and I, I wish I could give them the credit, but I've forgotten who it was on YouTube, and I'm going to show it to you because you probably haven't found that one YouTube video that I did. So here's how to make sure your connection is forever. The first step is to wrap all these multiple wires together and then get something that's going to hold the little connecting tube. And what we're going to do is we're going to heat this and we're going to melt solder into it. And then we're going to stick this in there and let the solder uh, dry out. And then the quick connect wire will be locked in there permanently. Now, there's a lot of safety issues with this. And let me go ahead and get all rigged up. I don't think it's possible to go overboard on safety. So I got my safety glasses. I'm going to put a face shield on because I don't want this to splash. And I'm going to wear leather gloves. So let me show you how this is going to work. There you go. Now, these are nice and cool, and they're in there permanently, and they're not going to come out. Now, let me show you real quick here the other trick of connecting these. You see there's a little down tab on this one. That's got to go in facing down, because that's going to connect on this little tiny piece of metal that you see right here. So when you stick it in, it can go all the way in until it snaps. You see how it went over the tab there at the back? So it's in and it's in there permanent. So while I'm doing this, what do you guys think? You think that's a decent way to make sure your marine wire is locked down? Do you have a better way to do it? Please share it with all of us. Thanks.